Today I'm going to teach you how to make a B-52 shooter. Now, it's named after the bomber. It's a classic staple shooter that everybody has to know. It's the first shooter that I ever learned. Actually, I even knew it before I started bartending. Had no idea what was in it, but I'd heard of the B-52. So what this is, it's a layering shooter. Start out with Kahlua, right? A third of an ounce, OK? Now, the, re the reason I'm doing it in this order is different liquors have different weights. Kahlua is very heavy, and that will go to the bottom. I want to layer this properly, so it should come out very cut and even. Get your bar spoon. Now, some spouts actually have a, uh, a blowhole spout. These particular ones don't. If you, don't have, if you do have one, put your finger over that, and it regulates the flow a little bit. Get your bar spoon. Pour into the bar spoon really slowly and let it gently come down Maybe a little bit more. Not bad. See how that nice line is? I love that. My director just reminded me to tell you that this particular drink is not really judged on the taste. It's judged on the look and the presentation, on how well you layer. And the last is Grand Marnier. Again with the spoon. This is the hardest one. So you got to be really gentle. Almost there. And there you have it. That is just about a perfect B-52. Now, if you're not confident in your layering skills or you don't have that much time, what I recommend is two things. Either chilling your ingredients, so keeping them in the fridge before you pour them, or if you want to be really sneaky at a party, pour a bunch of them, put them in your fridge for like an hour, and you'll come out, they'll be perfect. You're not cheating. You're just using the rules that suit you. B-52. Good shooter. Everybody should know it. But remember, driving is the one thing that doesn't mix with drinking. So have fun and play safe. We'll see you next time.